Good afternoon, beautiful people. I am devastated. I got this lovely Mother's Day gift. I've been using it every morning. <laughs> and I broke the handle. Anyways, happy Tuesday. I just wanted to do another video. I'm going to do a Dutch pour. My daughter requested... Um, three pieces of a painting and I'm going to try out some colors so she can have an idea and I've already gone ahead and flooded my canvas with my um, white paint but I wanted to do a little show um, I showed you last uh, the other day so this is my Butterf Monarch Butterfly Bloom lid turned out flipping amazing on my canisters amazing the other one it was okay the black didn't quite turn out so eh, it is what it is but it still looks pretty cool so anyways I wanted to show you those and with further ado here we go so I did the white I am going to use the Pablio iridescent blue green we are going to use the Tri-Art Thalo Turquoise Light with the Artist Loft Iridescent Medium. I am using the Tri-Art Ultramarine Blue, again with the Iridescent Medium. I am going to use the Artist Loft Thalo Blue with Iridescent Medium. And I apologize, this is Tri-Art. I don't know if I said Artist Loft. And I haven't marked it on my bottle yet, but this is the Extreme Sheen. Oh my goodness, it is the most amazing. It is the 24 karat gold. Now, if you remember my coasters that I put up in my last video, my show and tell, that had that Extreme Sheen in it. And oh my gosh, I had it at work and within five minutes they were sold. Crazy. So I'm just got a couple little hairs I noticed. I take them out before we go. Yeah, so this is an 8x10 gallery wrapped canvas. And here we go. Give everything a little bit of a shake. So I'm hoping that I can get this painting for my daughter because I'm excited to try it but it's a little big for where I have to go so I think I might have to remove everything off of my big table. I have an antique dining room set that my husband and I were gifted from his grandparents and we don't use it because just our household we don't have the room so it's been put in our basement so I got a piece of um what is it called white press board an eight foot by four foot and covered my table with a cloth and um that's what I've, my craft table is so oh my goodness this can be so pretty but I have to get rid of, I dropped a little couple of drops. Let's see if this will work. And it did. All right. Wish me, oh, look, this just looks so pretty already. Okay, let me give a little torch first here. Yeah, the canvases that she wants, they're one foot by three foot, so. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. All right, here we go. Amazing. She's a peacock girl. She loves peacocks. Um... I made her flowers for her wedding. There were sunflowers with peacock feathers. So um, I knew she would love the peacock colors. Oh my goodness. 
amazing. I'm just going to torch a little. Maybe I'll let it sit for a second or two. Oh my goodness. The colors are flipping amazing. That gold, I tell you. I went and I purchased also the, um, the garnet one. So I'm going to have to try one with that one. I'm let it sit for a sec. And then I'm going to... Where did I put my... My trusty water line piping. Let's see. Da -da -da. It's so pretty. I just want some more cells, so I'm gonna give it a let's give it a go here. The cells are there are beautiful. Oh, there's a few more coming up here. goodness and the sheen on this is amazing let's go a little here it looks like there's something underneath here come on torch are you kidding me i may have to fill it just give me a two seconds I guess the torching is going to subside at the moment. That is cool. Let me see if the heat going to work on low as opposed to the torch. It ain't going to do nothing. That's too funny. Hi, maybe? Oh, no. I don't want to blow that. Because that's quite pretty. I don't want to ruin it there. That one, so. Yes. Oh, my goodness. I just still can't believe that that is not working. All right, let's try it again. Oh, there we go. No, there's stuff there. Oh my goodness. Just gonna get the edges. I like when the white comes around the edges. Especially when it goes over. There we go. Oh, I don't want to burn the paint. Let's see. Oh, I did burn it here. Let me just see. There. Now that's a first for me. I think it was because of that, the heat gun. Now let's torch it here. There. Hmm. I'm tempted to get rid of that. Let me see if I can. 
I'm going to flip you around here, boys and girls. I don't know. Do I leave that or do I let it go? Oh, goof it. I'm going to leave it. It is so pretty that um, I'm just going to get the edges here. My white didn't go over all the way, I guess. Very sweet and cool. Well, there we go. That is today's painting. I think my daughter is going to be extremely happy with the colors because that's exactly what she was looking for. I'm pretty sure. Here, let me get you up there and take another look. Like, is that not the coolest? Very cool. And that gold is just amazing. Bye, bye, bye. Michaels, don't forget your coupon. <laughs> well, anyways, happy Tuesday. I'm going to do another couple more videos and we'll hopefully post them up this week. So if you have not yet subscribed, subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button because you have to like my video. And um, hit the bell and you'll get notifications when I have my next video. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye.